Hi Leo, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Leo with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, so this reading is all about advice. We're going to pull advice cards for love and romance and then career and finance. So let's see what the advice is for you, Leo, and love and romance. All right, so uh, forward direction. All right, so where is this going? Um, don't let your, your mind run away with all these different thoughts and then you get emotional about it. Get your emotions and your thoughts aligned so that you have control in this situation and you can steer the relationship. Okay, that's the advice there. Because when you're out of alignment, then it, you know, you're out of whack, and you're, you're out of control. You know, there, there's a, an emotional outburst that can happen or you get overly emotional or you, you act out or something of that nature. Also, you know, advice can work out, find a, a po positive outlet here. Maturity, okay, yeah. So think about where you really wanna be here. How do you want this relationship to mature? You know, where do you want it to go? Uh, think about the end game, the next chapter here. And that's why you need to stay in control. Let's see. Um, the spying, the questioning, and the inquisitive nature. Um, make sure that you choose your battles wisely. Everything is not an argument. Refrain from, you know, over indulging in conversation and questioning so that it doesn't turn into argument. Or this is what someone is doing in terms of you. But it says you need to do that. Look. You know, everything is in an argument. Learn what to say and what not to say. Be tactful in, in your speech, okay? Let's see. Yeah, uh, because what you say could sh shape um, the destiny, the trajectory of the relationship. You know, um, how you're acting and maybe being jealous or spying or um, being overly concerned with uh, could make some make your partner really want to change course or change their mind again change the outcome here of the connection here one more card let's see so it's like they want you to st yeah because abundance can happen here you know you can have what you really want you um you can have long-term success with your person um you feel like this is your soulmate uh you could have an abundance of you know good feelings love joy peace um, in this relationship, but it's all about how you, you come off what you do, you know, it's like the universe is trying to work with you so that you can, you know, maintain, you know, a level of, um, security within yourself first so that you don't become insecure and that kind of bleeds into the relationship. And then, you know, it's problems, right? And you, you, you don't go, the, the relationship doesn't go to where you want it to go. You know, you, you change the the course of the relationship. Like somebody changes their mind about you because maybe you're too you're too overbearing or you ask too many questions or you you don't trust or you don't know what to say or when not to say it, you know. All right, so let's see what um, the cards have to say for career and finance career and finance no need to worry okay whatever the worrying is about don't you don't have to worry everything is going to work out you have helpful people around you um if you didn't know it or not um ask you shall receive listen to your intuition if it's telling you to engage embark to do to go to make that phone call whatever listen don't um push it down um, the situation will improve. So maybe you're in a tough situation in your work place, um, in your career. Um, you don't know if this is going to take off, but it says something will improve. Okay. Um, be assertive. So be knowledgeable about what you're engaging in. Also go do the homework, go do the research to be assertive is to be confident. And you can only have confidence when you have knowledge of, okay. That's why people, if you, if I were to ask you to go you know, change the oil on my car. You say, well, I don't feel confident doing that. Why don't you feel confident? Because you don't know how to do that. So confidence is directly related to knowledge. So get the knowledge so you can move forward and you can be assertive in how you make changes and make moves in your career in finance. All right. 
that's what I have for you, Leo. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Go over to the website, book your own reading there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Leo, many blessings to you. Take care.